Hey guys, so I just want to show you how to export your UV mapping and import it to an outside photo editor like uh, GIMP or Photoshop. So if you watch my previous tutorial on texture painting, this is what you should have. Just a white cube. And what we're going to do is we're just going to, it should already be unwrapped, so here's your unwrapping. So we're going to save this. Should have already saved it too. You didn't just save as. Um, and now we're just going to open GIMP because that's the photo software I have. And I'm just going to go to File and Open. So now I'm just going to look for wherever I saved it to. So I just have a folder for all my mappings. All right, so now that I opened it, and it's very easy, I can right here in GIMP, oh, more detail on it, anything I'd like. So that's all I have to do. This is very helpful for like if you're creating a human model and you're, you want to texture paint the face to get all that detail in there. Uh, sometimes Blender doesn't have that ability. So it's nice to be able to get it to Photoshop or your favorite photo editor. Um, to know if your photo editor supports this kind of image, it should be a PNG, dot PNG, not GIF or G, not JPEG or GIF. So now that I have that, I just want to save it. Leave it open. So now that I saved it, I want to go back to Blender and you want to click on image and reload and it should reload your image so this is what I texture painted on the GIMP so now if I found out something I didn't like I can just go right in here and texture paint oh and you can texture paint right on your UV map I don't, I don't know if I forgot to tell you that or not just click on this paint brush down here and there you have it uh, and you can yeah you can also just texture paint it again with with Blender if you found something that you needed. And the cool thing about this is you can go back to GIMP and you can uh, you can change it like you know you can change whatever you want just save it and just you can just reload it you don't have to uh, close the file open it again you know you can just reload it you just have to make sure you, you just have to make sure you save it before you do that so uh, that's how you use Photoshop uh, I mean uh, GIMP and texture painting. So um, if you have any questions, please comment below. If you have any tips, comment below also. And thanks for watching.